Okay, so this is just a quick uh, walkthrough of the next version of the iPhone app, which is just about to go into Apple. Now, there's a lot of changes that won't be obvious from, from using um, the application. Um, there's a lot more robust file saving, so uh, you can quit the app and go back into it and start recording, uh, adding to recording, um, rather than it being locked as it was in the past. Um, it's got accessibility for blind users, so we've been working with a couple of partially sighted people on making sure that the application worked um, worked for them, which seems to do pretty well. Uh, we've built in localization, which won't mean anything, but it means uh, very soon in the future uh, you'll be able to access um, booths that are local to, to where you are. Uh, the battery usage is, is way, way better. We had a lot of complaints um, in the past that uh, it sucked usage, battery usage, which it did. Uh, it doesn't now. For example, I had audio open on my iPhone um, all night uh, and marginally affected the battery usage. A um, couple of crashes on audio playback and a whole bunch of um, bug fixes, minor bug fixes. So. You may be disappointed, but uh, there's a lot going on in the background. But the, the stuff you will see, um, one is the detailed view. Um, so now you have the ability when you're listening to a boo to view the, the data associated with that. So the tags, the picture, the location, uh, which does actually in beta testing make for a much better listening experience. And then we've also mimicked the uh, website functionality so rather than just seeing the most recent booze you can see um, a whole bunch of different ones um, actually in the app. Uh, other changes are the account screen no longer kicks you out to Safari to uh, complete your account that's done in app um, and there's this little screen here called uploads now this will not be enabled by default um, this is a premium feature uh, that we can set uh, via the server but what this does allow you to do is when you publish a boo and you haven't got uh, 3G or Wi-Fi access, you can then queue those boos um, to upload later when you do have um, a connection. So this is a, a, a feature that's been asked for a lot, um, but like I say, uh, initially when you first download the app, you won't be able to see that. Uh, that is set by us on the server and once we work out a way um, for you lovely people, uh, to pay for that, uh, we'll be enabling that. That will also increase uh, the time limit uh, on your app um, to 30 minutes. So that's that's the upgrade. There's going to be a few changes, particularly to the um, rather bland upload screen in a minute. But uh, essentially, that's that's the functionality in the next iPhone app.